Your is good, yo. It's your boy Ty back here with another video. And in this video today, guys, we're gonna be doing a game play of the new Diamond Evan Mobley in NBA 2K23, my team. Now, looking at Mobley here, seven feet tall, 215 pounds, 84 three ball, 85 standing dunk, 80 driving dunk. Can't really handle the ball. Does have a 92 block, 84 steal. 86 perimeter with a 92 interior, decent enough rebounding stats, 85 speed, as well as that 86 lateral quickness. Now, tendency-wise, for Mr. Evan Mobley, really solid all across the board, especially the contest shot and block shot tendencies. Five Hall of Famers, anchor clamps, menace, post lockdown, and rebound chaser. I'm going to say this about Evan Mobley. Offensively speaking, I don't think he's going to be great, but on the defensive end of the court, he is super complete. 33 gold badges, including some of those shooting playmaking badges, quick first step, interceptor, chase down, artist, off ball, pest. You got to give him unpluckable, maybe slippery off ball if you want him to be at his best. But the base Evan Mobley can't compete at the highest level. You don't even need to add any badges. And the best part about this card, I've been saying it for a long time. This is a great time to be a no money spent type player. Evan Mobley is what, 25,000 MT? It's a great time to be no money spent. Looking at Evan Mobley here in Shiran, the first thing I, would, I do want to say about Evan Mobley is the fact that his release is on slow. So if your case to not running Evan Mobley is the fact that his release is just too slow for you, okay. I mean, okay, what am I supposed to say to that? His release is slow. I'm not going to sit here and argue that because I have no argument to stand on. I mean, his release is really, really, really slow. Okay, think, of, think about it like this, okay? He's basically another version of a Kareem type slow release in which, yes, Kareem's release is really slow and people can get an easy contest on it. Evan Mobley's base is even slower and so it's going to be kind of tough for him to, I mean, honestly get that shot up but he is seven feet tall his player model is super large and he's gonna be great at attacking the rim is his release a downside 100 percent? i'm not gonna sit here and disagree but as long as you can green with it and as long as you can attack the rim i still feel like the card may be worth running as far as his dribble six his ball handle rating isn't great so you're not gonna be able to handle the ball that well with him not great dribble six but again, he's seven feet tall, can play that for 25,000 MT. We've got to like what we're seeing from Evan Mo. It's that simple. I personally like it quite a bit. The release, hate to break it to you guys, it's not great. No ifs, ands, or buts about it, guys. Evan Mobley's release in my team is definitely not great. And as I'm shooting with it, I feel like it's getting slower and slower. It's probably just me and me getting used to it, but man. It is so slow getting up there on that rim. The only real way to test how good Evan Mobley truly is, is to hop right into a My Team Unlimited gameplay. My opponent here has a outstanding lineup. I got no hate in my heart for his lineup. 83 and 35, pretty solid at the game too. It's gonna be real interesting to see what Mobley can do for me. Offensively, I don't really, he looks massive on the court. I'm just throwing that out there. I don't know how great he actually, that's a great shot ring. I don't know how great he's actually going to play, anything like that. But I'm just throwing that out there that he does look massive on the court. And defensively is is, is really why we're running Mobley, man. Forget offense. I got enough offense in my backcourt. Hey, got him. Chill, come here. Clamp breaker on gold. Clamp breaker on gold. Clamp breaker on gold. And one Mobley, your clamp breaker on gold. Yep, attack that AD. Attack him. Get back, good. Good time. Make him work. Make him work, good. Mobley there. Mobley there. Oh my Cookies. gosh, Larry. Why is Larry Zeus? Why is Larry Bird Zeus on this game? I don't know, don't ask me. I'm telling y'all, we're hooping right now. We are hooping right now in my team, good. Gotta come, gotta come, Mobley there. Mobley might be the best on-ball defensive player in the entire game. Am I over-exaggerating it? Maybe. But I'm telling you guys, he's going to be tough on ball. Play two at one. That's mine. Look at Mobley. Look at what Evan Mobley is doing. That's not even going to show up in the stat sheet because it's not a steal. It, it is, though. It, it really is a steal. Oh, my gosh. Y'all back. Larry back. Good. Nope, that's Mobley. It's Mobley in there. Stop playing with him. 
He not the one. Da, Larry. Oh my gosh, Mobley is just that man right now. That not being a foul is definitely kind of troll, but it is what it is at the end of the day. Good, come with it. Mine, mine, hit him. There we go. Finally, Larry, I'm missing that though. Like, am I not locked in? What is going on, Mobley? Golly, that release is slow. Even on the drifter, you noticed it was slow. Just sad, bro. Not watching that, not watching that, not watching that. Mobley, he not watching that. Ah, I jumped too early. I saw him get rim badge and I jumped. It's me. Reem, Reem, good shot Reem, another assist for Mobley. We're not watching that, nope. He hit that, he hit it, bro, that's not a good shot. Mobley, <laughs> yo, what in the Evan Mobley? I tried Euro stepping and that's the animation I got. Maybe it's cause he's just a little bit tired, I don't know, bro. He kind of getting bullied right now. And it's not like he playing bad. I've given him 19 points as a team, but he's just not playing to the level I need him to. Thank you, Mobley. Finally. Finally, Mobley. That's all I need. I don't need you dribbling the ball too much. But just show me that you can catch, attack the rim, and get to where you need to get to, your spot. Get over Oh my, here. did y'all see where his face was at? Huh. Yo, did y'all just see where his face was at on that? Nah, Mobley is different for that block. His face dang near... That's a great step back. Y'all seeing what he doing right now? Oh my gosh, did y'all just see Mobley though? Hey, Mobley, another easy one. Gold Vice Grip popping up. That block was crazy for Mobley. Halftime box score, yes, he needs a break. He had one steal, two blocks, eight points, four or five from the field. He was solid defense. Oh yeah, Shay, got him. By him, by him, standing dunk man, Mobley. Standing dunk man, Mobley, yup, get to that paint. How am I supposed to guard that, huh? Oh my gosh, Mobley is dogging him. He got clamp breaker. Yup, he got clamp breaker. That's all he need. It's only a certain amount of things you can do in that situation. Sweet spot. Sweet spot for Mobley. My greeny. It's a bad shot. My fault. He closed out. I should have bailed out. Yes, Mobley. Now on ball, he tough. If he, if he green that, that's a great shot. It's a tough shot, but it's a great one if he green it. MJ, MJ. Yep, straight by him. Straight by him. No force. No, no force in. Larry. Oh my gosh, Larry Bird, I see you, man. We win the game by what? 27 points, it really was never close. Mobley, 12 points, four assists, two steals, two blocks, only missed one shot, really solid. Now, the thing with Evan Mobley is when you look at the card, he's gonna be different than Jonathan Isaac and Thurl Bailey because those guys have quick enough releases. You can look at those guys as like hybrid fours. With Evan Mobley, he's just long, lengthy, can mash, but shooting wise, he's not really it. He does have a high enough three ball where yes, he can somewhat shoot. But his release is really slow that I don't look at him as a guy, you know, with a great three ball for, per se. So for me, does Mobley play? No. I mean, he doesn't make the best squad in the game. Now, if you are no money spent, one of the best power forwards in the entire game, because he's one of the most complete. I mean, you look at the card, he doesn't necessarily need any badges. And that is super important, especially for budget cards in my team. Would I take Thurl Bailey over him? Yes. Would I take Jonathan Isaac over him? Yes. But... 
I still love Evan Mobley in my team. So just because I'm taking those guys over him doesn't mean I hate Evan Mobley or that Evan Mobley can't play for you. So that's kind of where I'm at on the Evan Mobley hype train. I do really like the card, especially if you are nobody spent, but he does not make the best squad in the game. That is going to wrap it up for our video today, guys. Hopefully, each and every one of you guys did enjoy it. Drop a like on the video. Subscribe if you are new. And as always, man, I love you guys. And have a blessed day.